Hello South Africa. Who was DJ Somebody? Five facts about the murdered Omapiano star. Tributes have been pouring in since the sad news of the untimely passing of Omapiano pioneer and businessman DJ Somebody. According to a statement from his management, Some Sounds Music, the iPipe musician, whose real name is Upa John Safoka, died in the early hours of Sunday morning, November 20. The Monique Pole hitmaker was traveling on Woodmead Road in Gauteng when unknown gunmen sprayed his vehicle with a hail of bullets killing him and one of his bodyguards instantly. His second bodyguard was rushed to hospital. On Tuesday, November 22, the Safoka family announced his memorial and funeral details. First, he was born in Pretoria, DJ Somebody was born and bred in West Park, Pretoria on June 9 in the 1984. He was 38 years old. Second, a former taxi driver, the Ayamameza hitmaker started off transporting commuters on morning taxi routes to enable him to raise funds to purchase vinyls in high school. He drove his father's taxis. Third, DJ Somebody also worked as a radio presenter, the music producer also had a passion for radio. Before his big break in the music industry, he volunteered at a community radio station in Chwane. Because of his work ethic, he eventually got his own show Moshiedi on the Engage along with DJ Psycho and Lee on Chwane FM which he also produced. Fourth, he studied at the Chwane University of Technology, the musician enrolled at Chwane University of Technology but dropped out in second year as he could no longer ignore his passion for music. He went on to pursue his career as a professional house DJ. And fifth, DJ Somebody was a serial entrepreneur, the Ashin Wheeler artist was also the co-founder of iPipe Lifestyle which is a power suit restaurant by day and a club by night. Apart from co-owning iPipe Lifestyle in Pretoria and Cape Town, he was also the co-founder of the family transport business Gemeloto and Sun Transport. In addition, he owned music production company Sam Sounds Productions. Please subscribe for more news updates. This is Leah for the South African.